Okay, so I got my daughter with me and she wanted to show you that she got fishy crackers and milk. Okay, so I think what I'm going to do is I pulled out a whole bunch of junk and I, not really junk, fun stuff. And I'm going to make little clusters, like miniature ones, and then I'm going to put them in here. So I'm just pulling colors and textures. And I'm going to tear. Mama, guess what? What? I like these. You like the stars? Yeah, I like the colors. Like, yeah. Oh, that's great. I and I found some tickets. And sometimes we like to use the back of the ticket. So let's see. We were starting a cluster. I found some. Mommy, you have to hold me on. Stamps. And I found some different washies that kind of go just in my stash. None of this I've bought. I've bought it. None of this I bought recently. So, and then I also have just some, um, I think I'm gonna take this and tea stain it. I have tea, tea dye. Mama, what is that kind of ink? It's called tea dye. Oh, what does it do? It just dyes the edges to make it look like it's old or that it's dyed with tea. You know how I dye things with tea? Um, yeah. Yeah. I dye my Barbie's hair. You dye your Barbie's hair. I know you do. So, just giving it a little... Why are you taking the edges off? I like it to look like old. Mm-hmm. Honey, you have to hold me on. Why do I not go like this? Boom! Okay, I'm going to... Um, pause the video for a minute but there's me tea dying or tea distressing and be we'll be quiet. right back what uh, okay we're back all right so I'm getting my cluster together and I was thinking of adding in a little bit of this washi just kind of Maybe I'll add it on this here. Go on that. Give it some dimension. Let me zoom in a little bit. Mama? Yes, sweetheart. Um, why do you have your coffee up here? Oh, yeah, I've got my coffee. Yeah, I better drink my coffee. There's my coffee cup. I think I showed you in the last video. Mama, I like it. I, I love like, this coffee I like cup. I like it because it has kind of little flowers on it. Little flowers and little like designs. The that has the flowers on it. Mm -hmm. Yep, sweetheart, I do. You love flowers the best. I do like flowers a lot. So I'm just going to use... Yeah. I like, like pink ones and purple ones and blue ones. Awesome, sweetie. I'm going to use and this. And you got blue glass. So there's one cluster done. Awesome. And I also have some tags that are tea stained. So I also like that. You like that? She yeah. says she likes this. So, and I like the star tape. And she because, likes the star tape. I'm a star. Are you a star? Yeah. <laughs> yep, she's a star. That's for sure. So, I'm trying to think how I could use it. Mama, Mama guess what? What, sweetie? Hold on a minute. Can I? I'm so down. Wait. Okay. I'm going to zoom in. I got the little one all settled. <laughs> She's really sweet. She just wants some love. Um, these were something I found out of a magazine. So maybe I'll make that the tag. Nah, I'll just put it on the side. So... I should tear, shouldn't I? Here we go. Anyway, um, oops, this cotton. Never stop being a mom, right? Well, your mom's out there, understand? Um, but I love doing this, like making art, making videos. It just makes my heart sing, like. It makes me a better mom because I'm happier. So, and I, I've been loving doing my Etsy shop. I mean, just loving it. I just, 
thank you to all of you who have supported me in my Etsy shop and um, I will be doing lots more just haven't you know haven't I'm just starting slow just want to start slow so a little distracted by my daughter, which is totally fine. She's number one. Mm -hmm. I might just do that. I kind of like it just simple like that and then a little ribbon. I don't have any colored ribbon, but I have some tea stained um, seam binding and I have some of this, um, of my pants. <laughs> so I'm gonna use this. So I'll cut it right there. So it's starting to actually be summer here, which is so nice. Because it was really gray and dark for a while. And I love the rain, but I don't love the dark. I don't know if that makes any sense. Some of you might relate. I let well, I love water. So that's why I kind of like rain. It's water falling from the sky. There we go. That's just a nice little simple tag that you could write on. Um I'm just gonna use some of this. as a base for an embellishment. And then maybe some of this. And let me make sure I'm in, no, I wasn't in frame. Sorry guys, here. So hard to know. Um, so again, I'm gonna distress this just a little bit. I have um, a whole bunch of different um, distress oxides and inks on this little dauber so it kind of is a mix um, but I'm kind of liking the tea, tea tea dye one more than the vintage photo for something like this it's, it's a little bit lighter and I like that so we'll go like that we'll go like that mm -hmm. oh I was gonna use that Here we go. There's a nice little one that I can staple. So I know some people were doing, did I even get that in there? Yeah. Um, five layers, but I'm just doing whatever layers I have. Um, I have this from a magazine. I totally just cut out like textures. Sometimes I get magazines for donated to me, like given to me, like, hey, do you want this? So I don't subscribe to them, so I, I don't know what they are, but, um, <clears throat> and they have their magazines like, um, things for the home, curtains, and they have, you know, patterns like this. So that's a good source. Got a blue ticket here. What else do I have? I need a little pop of red, huh? Got some of this washi. I have not used any of this washi, but it's nice. So put it on here. And we got this. Got that. Ink that up. Then I need some sort of 
topper. Some sort of topper. I don't know, I might make tucks with these. So a little image, a little... Here's an image. I got out some of my stamps. Hmm. Here's another one. I tried to find like the red. Oh, I know. I could put some of these stars on it. My daughter will saw these on my desk and just was like, oh my gosh, what are those? It's like, have I failed you as a parent? You don't know what these stars are. We gotta show her the stars. So I loved these little stars when I was a kid. I remember when they were like peel and stick. Anybody remember that? Yeah, I'm sure you do. Huh. A little something more. Something whitish, creamish. There we go. So should get out some words but I'm just not in the word mindset right this moment but okay there's another one the one two three clusters one tag um, oh, I wanted to use that little tiny file folder that wasn't quite big enough, so I just cut it while I was talking to my daughter. I cut it. So this could be a tag, uh, like a tag, which I'm, I'm definitely making it a tag. And then it also could be a tuck. So maybe I'll cut it. Right there and I'll use my the only corner rounder I have is this guy so you know use what you have since it was already corner rounded I'll finish it off but if it wasn't I wouldn't round the corners and maybe I'll just this stamp right up front that would be a nice that's nice yeah I like that so ti this <clears throat> or ink it even just like the edge like this part of the edge I think is a good um, thing to do and I'm gonna glue this one I love this extreme glue Ex Elmer's extreme for something like this so Oh, there's an extra piece to it. Let's take that off. Give it a little bit more. I opened the window because it was getting so warm in here. I'm on the second floor of my house. So that looks really nice. And then I'm just going to, I'm trying to keep things kind of simple, you know, not a total um definitely no flowery i'm trying to i mean there are some flowers but not um floral it's not a floral journal um i don't want it to be frou-frou you know in that way um want it to be simple so i'm going to make a little hole punch there and it can be a little tag Okay, so then I'm going to put some of this seam binding for a tag. So without my daughter, I'm moving on quite, quite quickly. <laughs> I have to, otherwise she'll come back up, which is fine. I, she just, you know, wants to be a part of my life and I want to be a part of hers. But sometimes 
I just need a little space. And I work, I'm a working mom, so I need a little break. I think I'm just gonna put some staples there because again, I'm just trying to not be super frou-frou. So, and then this tag, it, it does fit in there, but it's a little tight. But I could take this. This is um, a photo that I have of um, mine. Ooh, what if I took my card and I cut my card down? Make it a little card. Put it in there. So, let's see. Okay, and I'm going to quarter round. Hopefully, with all the things I sell in my Etsy shop, I can buy myself a corner puncher. The corner chomper. There we go. We'll do, you know, that's a different corner. So let's do them all. Okay. So here's my cute little mini card that I just made. And I actually did, this one is actually, I put in my tea dye bath. Sorry, we have, we're vacuuming and so it actually, some of it is tea, real tea stained. I was just doing like an experiment, but okay. So let's see here how that goes. That is so cute. I love that. So a pocket in a tag from a mini file folder. You gotta get ingenious, you gotta get creative. So do I need something to pull that out? Like maybe just a little tab, like a little fold over tab, like something blue, maybe this washi, if I can get it unpeeled. You know, this is my favorite thing is unpeeling washi. <laughs> I had to take my nails off, so I'm actually, hold on, I'm fiddling, aren't I? Totally fiddling, but you know... It's kind of where my mind can just, I let my mind wander when I fiddle. But you know, I have so little time to do this and I, I'm not complaining. Somebody probably is going to say, you're complaining. I'm not complaining about the amount of time, but of course I like more. Am I going to get more? No. Is that okay? Yes, but when I'm not doing this, I'm thinking about what I'm going to be doing. And there we go. And so I have all these thoughts and ideas and it's fine. It's like I get a little in my head. So there we go, there's a little tab. So. One, two, three, four. I want to do something with this one because it just seems so cool. Oh, and my tag. I have these. I've had these forever. Like, I don't know that they must. I don't know what they're for, but I like them. So I'm gonna maybe not with that though. Let's see. I think I might. I want one more. One more of these, and I have some of this from a magazine. So, this is literally my junk. I have not, I mean, I've bought some of it, but it, none of it I bought for this project. And I'm really proud of myself for putting together a project that I didn't buy. Because I love to buy things. 
I mean, who doesn't? But I'm good at buying. Buying's quick and easy. Buying you can do online when you're sitting there with your children. Can't you? <laughs> yeah. I really want a flower press um, because I have <clears throat> some flowers in my garden. I do like to garden and I really like to garden flowers. Um, and I'm not a good gardener or a, you know, I don't even consider myself a green thumb, but you know, there's something so satisfying about like, oh, I'm going to use that side about something so satisfying about taking a flower bed and weeding it and then seeing the results and seeing that you, what you did, you know, and it's kind of like artwork you can see what you did okay there we go okay so I, I love just stapling it's just so freeing to staple <laughs> and so quick and easy so that needs a little tie I kind of want to cut this part off just use this part right here so this is the coolest lace I got it in a swap I don't remember who swapped it with me but thank you it's very bright blue and I think it's just adding the perfect perfect amount of pop to this journal or this yeah this journal this tag too Okay. My daughter, I don't know if you probably can't hear her, but she's four, almost four and a half, and she says dude a lot. <laughs> dude. <laughs> okay. That one doesn't have anything on it. I wish I had a little bit of red trim or red ribbon. I don't have any. Let me go see if I find some in my ribbon bin. Hold on. Dude. <laughs> okay. This is so flimsy. I might use this. Dude. I wonder if I can just distress this. I need a piece of... I have all this paper around me and I say, I need a piece of paper. Okay, see if this will distress. I'm going to heavily distress it. Probably should use vintage photo. Get vintage photo out. Big guns. There we go. Make it not so dark, just, or light, just. to bring in that, it's just so bright, you know. I'm hurrying because I can tell the kids want me. But I'm having fun. So this is the kind of steps that I do. So first I make the cover, which you could totally do last, but it helps because it gives me a size. Then I gather the pages, then I make the embellishments and the embellishments are really what give the journal, you know, character and uniqueness. Um, oh, I should say when I start, I pick a color theme or a theme like this is more a color theme, like red, white, blue, red, tea dyed, blue. That's kind of a big... Let's see, I'm struggling. Ooh. Okay, it's time for me to go be mom again, I think. 
unfortunately I'll have to end this video but I wanted to share with you kind of what I've been working on or wanting to work on and I just thought I'd turn on the camera because I don't plan things out very much I don't have time to plan so there we go so got this tag this tag these Oh, and this tag and little mini um, tag. And then these three embellishments. So I'm going to go and I'm going to count how many I think I might want. So how many I might, more I might need. And next time I get a little bit of time, I'll make another video. So thank you so much for watching. If you like, please give me a thumbs up. That really helps. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.